Ladies and gents out in YouTube land, welcome back. And if you happen to be new, my name is Mason George. I play with motorcycles. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe while you're here. So, a little overcast morning and uh, I was headed into the shop, cruising by. There's a guy that always has a garage sale and I don't normally stop because it's normally just clothes or whatever. But today, he has one like every Saturday, by the way. Anyways, today I was cruising by and I saw some handlebars poking up behind a table. So I turned around and I went back. And good thing that I did because this guy just happened to have a Greaves sitting there. I was like, dude, where'd you get the bike? And he said, apparently he was doing some work at a lady's house. It was in her barn or her shed, something like that. She didn't even know she had it. He ended up buying it, um, but he just, I think he got it for a couple hundred bucks or something. He said he just bought it to uh, try to make a few bucks on, and I was his guy. Um, I have a 62 Greaves. I believe that this one is a 61. Let's take a closer look, but uh, I wasn't going to let this one go. You never find Greaves. You got to buy them when you see them. So one of the funniest things about this bike is this awesome basket in the front. Like, that is just so killer. It is a 24 MCS frame, so that tells us it's a motocross scrambler. Like I said, I think it's a 61. My other one is a 62, I believe, if I remember correctly. And uh, this one is real similar in the exception of the gas tank and the exhaust. Mine has an aftermarket exhaust. This one might be stock, I'm not sure. I don't believe that carburetor is stock. Um, the engine is free though. The engine turns over and uh, I was playing with the, the sprocket and the transmission and I think that's good too. But you can hear it. Kind of sounds like it would want to start, sort of, kind of. I love the tank. So much character. The seat's not in that bad a shape. Um, but yeah, like I said, this basket is just killer. Cool old sticker, Webco. Wheels in pretty good shape. Little front number plate. I don't know if that's a homemade jobby or not. Aftermarket handlebars. I don't believe they were chrome. The more I look at the, the number plate in the front, the more I'm thinking, yeah, she's probably a homemade jobby. Cool little brackets there, and it uses the the factory bottom mounts and if anyone can tell me what that sticker is that'd be pretty cool i can i dig that big time all right guys i just wanted to show you my little uh saturday morning garage sale score really stoked on this thing not for sale so uh if you were thinking about asking probably not for sale this one's gonna go in my personal collection i have a 62 that we refer to as jack um, and I think that this one would look really good sitting next to it. But, you know, I guess for a price, everything's for sale. But for right now, I'm not really looking to sell it. Um, I love these little bikes, so pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in. Like I said, if you happen to be new, please subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys on the next one.